Ho, 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 whoa, 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 But not in that dress. Why? You're asking me why I'm acting like this? Come here. Come here. I need to talk to you. Yes. First of all, my fair lady, this outfit doesn't Suit the weather outside. Are you sure you want to go out like that? I mean, it's freaking cold outside. And you are going... <sighs> Baby. Why? Are you just trying to get me mad or so? <laughs> no, 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 no. Huh? You think there is another reason why I'm acting like this? Well, I just told you. The weather. It's pretty cold outside. Why would you wear that and then get sick? And then? Yeah. I have to take care of you. And I love to take... You know, I love it. To take care of you. But I don't want you to be sick. I want you to be healthy. So. It's clearly. Not the right outfit for this weather. What do you mean? Another reason. Huh? Be more specific. So I can tell you that. There's nothing else bothering me. <sighs> Well, I won't let you go, that's for sure, if you're not, yeah, putting a jeans or so on. Because, uh, no, I won't let you go. Because it's so cold outside, and it's raining, by the way. Don't you see that? <sighs> okay, okay. Baby, listen. You know what, I know sometimes you're trying to, you know, yeah, provoke, provoke me and, you know, get me some kind of mad. <laughs> and you actually succeed with that. <sighs> well, there's another reason, okay? I admit that. But... I mean, you know that. If you're going out like that, you're like... <sighs> you know, the world out there is so dangerous. There are so many bad dudes out there that, you know, would like try to kidnap you or so and, you know, do bad things. And I truly don't want you to be hurt or, you know, kidnapped. And seen as an object, you know. I mean, you're beautiful. And I love this dress on you. But when you're going out alone with your friends, uh, I truly don't want that. Yeah. I mean, of course, I let you have fun with your friends. You can go and do whatever you want, but... It, it doesn't feel good to me, like, when I know, okay, my beautiful baby, you know, is outside there in this, <clears throat> you know, gorgeous dress, and you're, like, you know, celebrating at a house party or in a club, wherever, and then there are definitely other boys that are, you know, trying to chase you and talk to you and And I don't like that. You know, I don't like this idea. I don't like this thought of somebody, you know, 
coming up to you and talk to you or even touch you, it really drives me mad. So, you know, you're mine. Yes, this is what I want to say and to express is that I not only care about you and not only love you, but I want you to be mine. Like, do you understand what I mean? Oh, okay, so you understand. <laughs> I knew that. You were just playing with me, huh? Because you, you already know that I'm, you know, kind of possessive. Yeah, I want you. And you're just mine and nobody else will get you. Yeah. I got your heart, you got mine. I mean, you are mine. Yes. And no, I wouldn't, I would never share you with anyone else. No, that, that would be stupid, you know? So, nah, I love you, you know, from the bottom of my heart. And I can literally just say that I want you so bad that, um, you know, I can't like, I can't deal with this thought of you going out there being in this dress and I don't like that. Like, if you would go straight away right now, throughout the door, close the door and leave me like for a few hours, like literally, I wouldn't be able to sit here and, you know, watch some series or read a book or do anything else, my mind would just be focused on you, like, the whole time. I wouldn't be able to do anything because my mind would be just focused on you because you are mine. Do you understand? Like, you would make me so crazy. Huh? This is a prank? Are you for real? You just wanted to test me? <laughs> Damn. Give me your hand right now and feel my heart. It's really pumping. Yeah, do you feel that? It's just because of you. Yeah, you make me crazy, like, <laughs> in a good way though, but like, look. It's pumping so fast. <sighs> baby, baby. So you were actually just wearing this dress on purpose to get me mad and prank me. Though you already know how I, you know, react according to your outfit and what you're about to do. I can't believe that. Again? You're pranking me again? I think... This has... Yes. There has to be some consequences for you, my fair lady. Sure, I won't tell you when or what would happen to you. But I can tell you there is some revenge incoming. <laughs> so, yeah. Are you even leaving today? I mean, if this was just a prank of yours, are you going to leave me? Or will you stay with me? Hmm? Oh, okay. So you're still leaving me, huh? But just in a different outfit? <laughs> all right, all right. That is what I wanted to hear, because you just belong to me, okay? Remember that. Wherever you go, I have your heart. And the same counts for me, too. When I'm gone, like going out and stuff, you have my heart and I belong to you. That's called a relationship, right? 
yeah, it's true love. I, I, I. So go back to your closet room and put something else on. And then you can, you know, have a great time with your friends. Of course I let you go. I mean, I'm not like here. Of course, you know, you belong to me. You know, you are mine. But still, I let you go because, you know, who... Like, it wouldn't be right if I just, like, hold you here with my hands, like, closed and won't let you go anywhere. Like, it would be wrong. So, you can do whatever you want because I trust you. Okay, I trust you. So, it doesn't matter to me. I was just saying, um, you in this dress, I mean, it's just like a magnetic energy ball that would, like, drive everyone around you crazy. And I'm talking about the boys Okay, because I know how they think. Okay, so please don't do that again. I, yeah, I, I, I. go that, go that. <laughs>